here on the SBR TV NFL Experts Roundtable. All right, Scott, the game you want to talk about, Giants at Dallas. Now, I'm interested to see what you have to say because both these teams strike me as so unpredictable. I wouldn't really feel comfortable betting on or against either of them. Uh, I haven't f- felt that way all year. The, the Dallas is a three-and-a-half-point home favorite right now. Dallas are looking iffy. Tony Romo, of course, has a reputation of wilting a bit in, in December. Uh, Dallas has been losing against the spread. The Giants did just come off of a, uh, of a, of a cover and a near win against Green Bay last week. So so I guess guns at guns in my head. I guess I take the Giants plus three and a half. How do you see this game? Uh, I like it. <laughs> I like it just the other way. Um, <laughs> I, I'm going to look to take Dallas in this game. Uh, okay. You know, past history here, the Giants. I think have, have really dominated Dallas at home uh, in Dallas. So I can't. I can't say it's you know because Dallas has played the Giants very tough at home. Typically, they've been pretty high scoring games. I make the number here actually uh, just looking. I've got Dallas favored by about eight and a total of 51. So. The past history here has been a high-scoring uh, series as well in Dallas, so I'd probably take a look at the over. But the reason for the play, uh, other than I think I've got some value with Dallas, is mm-hmm. they qualify in probably my three best rush, rushing situations, which have hundreds of uh, samples to them. And this year have been very good. One's four and two this year. One is 16 and eight this year. Another one is 25 and 12 this year. Dallas qualifies in all those situations. And the Giants are really banged up on defense. Yeah, they may have lost Kenny Phillips last week. I don't know what his status is for this week. Um, I think that may catch up to him a little bit. Miles Austin should be back for Dallas this week, which will help them in the passing game. Um, and so I think just Giants on the road with a banged up defense um, and, and Dallas at home with the rushing situations in their favor. And my numbers say there's some value with Dallas. Um, so I'm going to look Dallas' way. And I agree. They're, you know, Dallas doesn't blow a lot of teams out this year at home. They have blown a couple teams out, but they've been really bad teams. Uh, certainly not not um, as good as the Giants team. So there is some risk there, I think, in, in trying to take them and lay some points. But uh, I got to believe in my numbers, and I certainly believe in the situation. So uh, for for those reasons. I'll look to take Dallas, and I may take a look at the over in this game as well. All right, yeah, well, I, I admit I have been sort of like eyeing Dallas each week, looking for a spot to pounce to where they will get their cover. I didn't take it last week because, uh, you know, that didn't look right to me. But here it, it does look a little bit tempting, and um, and the points you make make it a little bit stronger. Uh, Dave Golikoff, does either side tempt you in this game? No, not at all. Just okay. as you uh, introduced this game, Peter, I, I feel the exact same way. I mean, these two teams are so inconsistent. Yes, you know, the Cowboys have – played well the last, uh, what, seven games or so, Uh, but they haven't been covering the spread consistently, and that's really what we're talking about in this spot. Um, You know, the Giants, very tough team to predict. Sometimes they get up and really play well against their competition, you know, play to the level of their competition, i.e. last week against Green Bay. Other times they, you know, they they wilt under that pressure uh, playing the Saints a couple weeks ago. I think if you are going to play this game, you probably look at the total and try to find some value there. But mm-hmm. otherwise, these are two inconsistent teams. Maybe the Cowboys win but don't cover. So um, maybe you take the Giants, but the Giants are so inconsistent as is. So I have no play. Maybe look at the total. 